Still using Optifine for shaders in 2025, you are leaving performance and better graphics on the table. Most people don't know about this, but Optifine isn't the best way to run shaders anymore. It's outdated, slow and doesn't play nice with other mods. If you want smooth frames, beautiful visuals and full mod compatibility, you need to switch to Iris and Sodium. In this video, I will show you exactly how to install shaders in Minecraft 1.21.6 using Iris and Sodium. No crashes, no confusion, just fast, gorgeous gameplay. Alright, why are we doing this? You have seen Minecraft look like a movie, realistic water, dynamic shadows, glowing sunsets. Let's get you set up. Step 1. Run Minecraft 1.21.6 once. Just launch it and open a new world. You don't need to play, it just needs to create the right folders. Step 2. Install Fabric. This is the mod launcher that lets your iris and sodium run. Go to fabricmc.net and download the installer. Choose client, set it to 1.21.6 and click install. Open your Minecraft launcher and you will see a new profile called Fabric. Step 3. Download iris. Go to irisshaders.net and grab the installer. Choose install as fabric mod. Pick 1.21.6 and hit install. That installs both iris and sodium together. Launch Minecraft with the fabric profile. Head into options, video settings and if everything's working you will see a a new tab called shaders packs. That means Iris is running. Now let's install some shaders. Head to safe site like Curseforge and search for shaders compatible with Iris. Here are some great ones. Complementary shaders, VSL shaders, Sildur's Enchanted Default, Nostalgia. Go on the shader you want, it will come as a zip file. Don't unzip it, just drag the zip into your shaders packs folder. To find that folder go to your Minecraft, Options, Video Settings, Shaders Packs, then click Open Shaders Packs folder. Paste the zip file in, that's it. Now go back to your game, select the shader from the list on the left and load a world. If all went well, Minecraft should now look unreal. Reflections in water, soft shadows, real sunlights, it's like a new whole game. But what if things go wrong? Let's say the screens go white or black, or the sky disappears. That usually means one of two things. Your graphics drivers are outdated, or the shaders packs isn't supported on your hardware. Fix it like this. First, update your graphics drivers. Go to NVIDIA or AMD site and grab the latest version. Don't skip this step. All drivers break the shaders. Second, tweak settings inside the shaders packs. Every shader lets you customize it. Just click shaders pack settings in the shaders packs menu. If your game is laggy, turn off shadows, reduce water effects or disable fancy lighting. You can make most of the shaders run great even on a mid-tier laptop just by tweaking a few options. Also, Iris plays nice with other fabric mods, so you can add things like lighting for more performance, mock menu to manage your mods in-game, starlight for better lighting performance or simply voice chat or minimap mods, whatever you like. Wanna use texture packs with shaders? Watch the next video on the screen right now.